Today I will demonstrate how to enable logging for the IT Shop web application. The topics covered in this video will include open the webdesigner.configfileeditor.exe tool, specify the file path of your logs directory, and review the instructions for submitting logs. Please note, the tutorial performed in this video will be done with a version 6.0 environment. We need to open the Web Designer Config File Editor. Open Windows Explorer and navigate to the bin directory under the Identity Manager web root. Scroll all the way down to webdesigner.configfileeditor. and double click to open. Select the web config file for your identity manager website and click open. Establish a database connection with your system user account and then click connect. Expand the log section with the arrow on the right. With these settings, you can specify what types of events you'd like to include, as well as how long you would like to keep the logs for. In the log directory field, you will see the default file path for the logs. If required, you can also enable the SQL logs by entering a file path. In this case, I will copy the default logs path. Go to the file menu and click save. You can then close the web designer configuration editor. Once you have reproduced your issue, you will need to collect the logs for a review. Navigate to the file path specified in the log settings. You will then need to zip up the log files and submit them to support. 